Well, first target of today. Got a relic. Look at that. It's my first hole. Looks like an old buckle or a latch. Those two catch pieces there at the ends. That's a nice little old bit of history there, that's for sure. I've been here before, got a lot of stuff out of here. So, just got here nice, bright and early. Take advantage of the cool weather and off to a good start. So, I don't expect to be here too long today. It's gonna kick around a little bit and uh, test out a new area. This one was coming up uh, really nice. Not too deep, look. Got my first silver of today. Been here about 10 minutes. I don't suspect it will be too, too old. And it's not. It's still a King George VI. So date wise, hmm, I gotta clean it up a little bit more, get a date on it. But uh, probably in the 40s, early 50s, uh, possibly before 54 anyway. But yeah, second signal, silver dime. That's pretty sweet. Same hole. I filled it back in, scanned it again. I had another signal where I got that silver dime from. So it's in here. Let's see if it's another one. Shallow, shallow. And it's a penny, unfortunately. See it right here? It's not old. Recent one. This, I can't see being down with the silver. This is probably on top of it, but just a regular penny, probably in the 90s. Well, just working my way along here. Ended up beelining it this way. Dug a nice deep plug. There it is. Look what we got. I'm not sure what that is or what those are. I'm guessing, based on the color, that they're probably US quarters. So let's see. There it is. Bit of a coin spill. Here's one. There's two. So yeah, they're US uh, quarters there. 1983, this is probably around the same age. But that was pretty cool, eh? Neat color on these. So, hmm. We got the old silver dime, we got that old bracelet, uh, the buckle type thing, sorry. And some recent coins as well. So, looks like we might get a mixture of everything on this hunt. Obviously dropped together. U.S. dime and a U.S. nickel and all around the same age up here 85 or something like that got the water out you know what that means we have a large copper in the hole I dug the plug actually it was a really sketchy signal but I figured I'd dig it because the other signals I was getting were uh, pretty predominant and there were newer coins. This one was a bit sketchy, figured it might be a little bit deeper and it was. I dug this, it's not in here, it was in here. So I dug around a little bit and you guys see it right down there? Or a large, could be a large scent. All right. Uh, it is an older token. I think these ones, I'll put a picture of this one up so you guys can see it there. I'll leave it right there and I'll put the picture up just to the right. But I believe, and I could be wrong, 1840 on this one. Yeah, it's an Oswe. You guys can see it right in there, right in the middle. So that's an old copper, 1830s, 1840s, I believe. That wasn't too bad. So this is a good, good sign. This is exactly what we came looking for today. Some of these old coppers. So might be in a good spot. Let's keep moving. It's 
in the corner. That's good. That should do it. I don't want to hit it. This is stupid, really. A live dig. Oh, oh, you guys see that right there, eh? It's not silver, but look at the size of that copper. Oh, ho, ho, ho. all right. There it is. Live dig. Nice. So, this is a big piece of brass or copper. And there it is. The date's gonna be really, really small. You guys should be able to see it. It's right at the end of my finger, 1837. That's a big one penny. I haven't found one of these for a while. I think the last time I found one of these, I was out with Kirk. But there you go. Nice. That was a really nice deep one. Sweet. Gonna kick around here. Slow and low. Well, the first copper I got was around here. The other one was over here. So I had one there. I believe I had one in here. Came in around the back end. Got us another sketchy signal right here. Dug the plug. Scanned it with the pinpointer. Had it in the corner. But because I don't have my hand digger, I figured I'd just... Stick my shovel in the corner, and we're gonna pull this out together. I have no clue if it's trash or not, but you never know, it's the same sort of depth. So, let's see. Let's check the hole first. Nope, so it's in here. Oh, oh, another one, right on. Nice. Oh, this is a Bank of Montreal one. Wow, everything just in this small area. I'd say what, six feet by six feet max. Awesome. This is, uh, I think around the same as the other one, 1837, 1840, somewhere around there. So it's a half penny token, Bank of Montreal. You see the house on this side. Wow, crazy. Right in here, one, two, three, and there you go.